Lydia. Hello. Show me in your outfit. Show me. Show me. Are you going to sit on my knee? See if we can do it like this.
now. <laughs> I'm all these toys and you're playing with the air holes. <laughs> I just got a right picnic going on. Got some carrot or some carrot. Oh, you got some. Did you enjoy that cake? Did you enjoy it? So we've come out of the party and we thought I needed to nip it home bag and so I nipped in there and as you can tell I am a drowned rat. The rain is just absolutely ridiculous. Didn't bring a coat with me and poor Lydia got woke up because when I took the rain cover off the rain actually fell onto her and she just kind of went all funny and she's Oh, you're awake now. Yeah. <clears throat> as soon as we finished the party, put a coat on, put her in the pram. She was just out for the count within seconds. And she's only just woke up as I got her into the car. But you can't really see. No, you can't really see it because we're under the shelter in the petrol station. So it's gonna go home now have some um, dinner and get a bath. Can't go out looking like this if we're going out tonight. So, but Nana's there. She'll look after Lydia. See my makeup smushed as well. Jeez. Shocking. Right. I think we need a cup of tea. Crazy. Crazy. Hang on, stay there, stay there. Stay there. Oh, I never got stuck in your teeth. Damn. With all our teeth, I did. Um, Fish fingers, chips and mushy peas. Um, so I just got out of the shower. Um, it's getting ready to go out. Is it going out and about? Well, the film starts in an hour. So let's get this to the gates. ridiculously cold and I'm so tired. I've just got upstairs, had full intentions, just jumping straight into bed. And I ended up just tidying tidy in the bedroom and trying to give my bedroom some sort of organisation and now it's like it's now quite swell. But I know that like, it starts to bug me like upstairs um, because it's hard for me to do what I want to do upstairs. Um, not having 
the baby gate across the top of the stairs. I've got one, but it's fell off the wall numerous times and I just kind of give up with it now. But because the black plasterboards, they just don't want to stay up. So therefore, I can't have the deer upstairs because she just literally tries to walk off the step like it's not there. Um, so I'm quite funny about leaving her upstairs with me. And then because now she can open doors, kind of, um, it's difficult to actually be in one room when she wants to be in the other room. Um, so I'm just going to try and get it that sorted. Um, so I've kind of my clothes that actually fall out the wardrobe um, because all the clothes are heavy. So that's why I bought those vacuum packs. So I'm going to strip them all, probably, <sighs> tomorrow, tomorrow night maybe, if I've got enough time because it's just ridiculous. And I don't even wear any of the clothes that are in that wardrobe, it's just why them drop. The majority of them are like dresses and um, summer clothes. So I don't really bother, I don't even know why I've got, I don't know why I've got a wardrobe. Um, so yeah, I'm not scruffy really. The bedroom can get untidy sometimes, it's only because like, I sleep in it. <laughs> it's never dirty. Um, and before, like, before I had the idea, like, especially whilst I was pregnant, like, everything was just tidy. But having a child just doesn't allow you to do the things you want to do all the time. So I just normally leave it till now. Ooh. I leave it till now I do. Anyway, now that's done and I've told you about my terrible wardrobe breaking and my clothes falling out of the wardrobe. Let's forget about that. <laughs> um after the party today we looked into home bargains and I got some more of these, what time has it gone? Some more of these frames. I think I got five um, to do for the stall. I'm gonna do those up. Oh man, so it's gonna be quite good. Don't sell them, stick them in the dear's bedroom. Win win situation. Um, as you've seen, we went to the pictures as well. I thought it was quite good, I enjoyed the film, and yeah, it was nice to have some time with me and Colin, at least we actually got out as well, that was the main thing, um, yeah, I came home, just had tea, chilled out for a little bit, that was it, and I'm very sorry about today's vlog being very long, I've now rambled on for four minutes, and I just can't cram anything in anymore. The first day I was like, what do I talk about? And now it's like trying to shut me up is the problem. Um, so yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here because I'm sure you're sick of seeing me right now. Um, yeah, Bella's like under the covers. There <laughs> she is. I look. <laughs> I actually have just seen like this bulge bit here. I thought that was like she was curled up around here, but obviously that's where she is. So from us all, it's a good night. And if you've enjoyed today's vlog, you know what to do. And we shall see you tomorrow. Good night. <laughs>